everybody, my name is the Epic Pikmin, and welcome back to Let's Play Super Mario Odyssey. Or last episode, we did the Cap and Cascade Kingdoms, now we're in the Sand Kingdom. And there is ice for reasons. Yeah, the coins are only good in this kingdom. This is so c c cold. Everything is just f froze all of a s s sudden. Alright, so we can hop around and on the table and get the coins. You ever get lost? You head for that bright glowy light, okay? So yeah, this is pretty much based off of Mexico. The land of Mexico. I'm, I'm trying not to sound racist, and I might be sounding racist. Oh, man, I wanted to get that moon. Yeah, I can just... This move because we're gonna need a lot of them if we want to get the Odyssey to the next kingdom. But there's also this place here, the Crazy Cap. It's a store. It's in all of these kingdoms. You can buy stuff with coin, normal coins on this side, and purple coins on this side. Hey, hey, hey! We accept two kinds of coins, normal coins and purple coins. We can use normal coins anywhere, but purple coins only right here. Hey, hey, hey. So I can get a sombrero, a poncho, a cowboy outfit, and this, these decorations for the Odyssey. Come again. I'm gonna buy here. Hey, hey, hey. I can get this stuff. Okay, I guess I'll buy this heart. There. And I can also get a power moon. Also, power moons change color depending on what area you're in. Or what, what kingdom you're in. In the last kingdom, they were yellow. In this kingdom, they're green. Let's go, go see if I can find a 15th moon. So I can, uh... Get that sombrero. Uh, I saw the craziest couple come racing past on the way to the ruins. I f figure they're still out that way. Okay, can I get that 15th purple coin? Bowser's footprints, where? Oh, here, here. Okay. Oh, there's some purple coin. I just need to find a way up there. Okay, let's go. Coins. Come on, come on. Come on. Okay, now we can check out the water pipe. What is in here? There's a prize in this party room, but to find it, you'll have to feel it. Walk around, feel the rumble, let it move you to the prize. Okay, so you gotta 
use the HD rumble on the Joy-Cons to find a power moon hidden in this room. Ha-ha! Found it! A rumble from the sandy floor. So that's three power moons so far. We are doing fine. Ow. Okay, now we can go back into the crazy cat. And dress appropriately for the world. There we go. El Mario. Okay, let's. Okay, now we can go to the desert place temple thing. Watch me roll. And you can't capture the tiny Goombas, by the way. You can catch, you can capture regular sized Goombas, and I think there are actually some regular sized Goombas here in this. This. Uh, area here, which is pretty much regular 3D Mario platforming level, in case you were wondering. The Rumble's doing something here, and there are coins. A rule for the ground in this game. If it's shiny, there's a power moon under it. It may not be here, but it'll definitely be later. So, this is just camera thing. You can see that we need to get to the highest tower. Right there where there is a power moon. So there are 100 purple coins in each level. So, yeah. Okay, let's capture a bullet bill. Head on across. Good. And divert all of these. There's a power move here. We gotta move. We can make the sign spin. Travel tip ground pound. Blah blah blah. Cappy already read that to us. And 
then there's that awesome chain. And then we can go into this 2D thing. gonna be over there. Still that right there. Come on, Bull Bill. Bill. Let's get this power moon. This time, you just get out of here. Okay, let's just head into this next 2D thing. Toasted Toast Arena Ruins Round Tower. And we have also got this moon. So next is this. Moon Shards in the Sand. Throw our caps into these things and they send Cappy out farther. So there's that. Good 
thing. Oh, I got, I got it. And this is a chain reaction. This is not good. We gotta get out of here. Okay, Mo, I have its hat. Okay, we are now a Mo. Also, if Mario touches one of these cacti, one of the needles gets in his nose. Well, on his nose. Also, Moais can see invisible platforms. Prints. Head up here. You get all sorts of stuff. I can't find anything. Where is it? in the sand. So now we can go into that upside down pyramid. Showdown on the inverted pyramid. 
Hey, there's Paige. Hey. Let's get a survey. So, uh, that's the Inverted Pyramid. That's where we gotta go. There's Bowser and Peach with a giant wedding ring that is the binding band that Cappy was talking about earlier. Things are heating up at the Inverted Pyramid. They must be trying to steal our legendary binding band. No, 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 my beautiful sheep. The three of them have escaped, and now I'll never get them back. Let's help this guy find his sheep. There's one right there. Sneak up behind him. He's gonna... He's gonna go right, right into the cactus. Okay, there's one. I've got a customer waiting, but from the looks of this mess, I'm not going anywhere anytime soon. Er. Okay. I am a sheep, but I also got another power move. the sheep and another power moon thank you oh, we got a moon herding sheep in the dune there's a sphinx over there can I talk to it greetings traveler and to your hat as well can you answer my riddle what does the thieving monster desire from this land? Ring. You are correct. Perhaps that wasn't much of a riddle. Any who proceed. Yeah, that really wasn't much of a riddle. And we can go in here now. And we get all of these coins. Another power moon. Okay, now let's go. Uh, there's the inverted pyramid. Are we going to to this guy? I saw a weird couple going into the pyramid. I think they're going to see our celebrated binding band. Okay. Let's head inside. The inverted pyramid. How come the hat just turns back into Mario's whenever it captures something? Uh, why is that? I like that one level in Super Mario Galaxy 2. That's a uh, name I can't really remember. Let's 
uh, head on out here. And, uh, we are upside down. Okay, let's just... Oh, wait. Wait, there was something... Yeah, there's this. Yeah, there's a power move. Okay, there, I got a power move. Okay, now we can go back inside. I, dang it, I crouched to avoid the bullet bill and I... Okay, there. Clear the whole thing. And we get this. Tails. And they'll give us stuff like coins and power moons. Just missing. But we can get coins. Okay. Now we can go ahead and head on up. Another bunch of piranha plant bouquets on the airship. Uh, looking for the binding band chumps? Too bad. The boss has it now. And you guys ain't invited to the wedding. Alright, this one's name I'm very sure is Harriet. Yeah, it's Harriet. Oh, we gotta get one of these bombs back at her. She's just gonna go absolutely crazy. She 
actually takes three hits. Whereas the green one, whose name I'm pretty sure is Topper. Or maybe something else. Yeah. And there. I'm hitting her with the hat because that stuns her. Because she'll run away if you don't. It'll make it harder to hit her. Alright. We got... A multi-moon. From a showdown on the inverted pyramid. And now it's night all of a sudden. And the inverted pyramid is now in the sky. The hole in the desert. That brutal slowed us down a bit, but we're still racking up power moons. How odd, the inverted pyramid is floating and it's gotten so much colder. Is this more of that Bowser's doing? I say, he does make trouble, doesn't he? Alright, we'll head over there, but first... Let's deposit all of these power moons. The Odyssey has powered up. Oh, we've hit a proverbial fork in the road. Which kingdom do you think Bowser went to? The Lake Kingdom. Lake Kingdom, a splendid idea. But for now, we are doing to stay in the Sand Kingdom, because we need to head over there. Maybe you can open the map. You can select any champ point flag. Let's select the one closest to where we're going. Would that be here? Yes, it would. And there are a bunch of skeleton ghosts that you can't capture, by the way. And now we are going into this hole. Into a full-on ice level in the underground temple. Whoa, 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 whoa. Capture Goombas, and Goombas can't slip on the ice. But we don't need it right now. Oh, almost fell. This was a bad idea because we are now not tall enough to reach any of that. Mm. 
Oh, hey, the Goombas respawned. start this because I messed it all up. It. Yes, I can. That is good. This is a tall stack. It should be enough. This is a very tall Goomba stack. So look, we got this power moon. stuff we can go let's see if I can kill all these Goombas this was a bad oh there there that was awesome Deepest underground. Okay. Let's take a bullet bill over there. Okay, good. For a second, I thought I was going to ground pound right into the abyss. But I didn't. Now we get to fight the boss. This thing. Where? Ring. Go. 
You take ring. No, me no take ring. Me no take ring. Me no take ring. Me no take ring. But you do have to get him to punch the ice so you can capture his hands. And then you can punch him in the face. That's gonna happen. Ow. Okay, there, we got him. Now. died and now probably have to do that whole fight all over again from the very beginning yes we do also I can see Mario's hand clipping through the sombrero We beat him. Is that him realizing we didn't take the ring? Is he Gollum? Is it like a version of Gollum? Oh well. We got another multi moon in the hole. In the desert. And away we go. And it's daytime again. Yeah, it's so hot now. But I do suppose that's what we were trying to accomplish. If we keep, excuse me, up this pace, we'll catch that Bowser in no time. Do we have enough power moons to reach the next kingdom? If you want to check, put me on the globe. Well, I know we do. But first, I want to introduce you. Uh, this is a toad that will charge you to put the location of a power moon on your map. And this is Uncle Amiibo. You can use him to tap Amiibos, and uh, he'll have them search for power moons, and he'll give you the location of the power moon on the map. But now let's just load in these power moons we found. We now have 27 power moons. And now we will head off to another kingdom, the Lake Kingdom. Off. 
to the lake king. He kidnapped Tiara, and now with this binding band, he's got a wedding ring. Is he going to steal a whole wedding? Seeing as how we got some time to kill, let's review some useful skills. Travel tip, homing cap throw. After throwing your cap, shake the Joy-Con again to perform a homing cap throw. Your cap will fly toward the nearest target you can see. It's super handy when your aim is a little off. Well, there it is. Next, let's read up on the Lake King. It says they're known for their fashion and... Oh, there's a famous wedding gown there called the Lock Lady Dress. It's a dress. And... Bowser's trying to have a wedding. I'll let you put that one together. Anyways, this is Lake Lamode in the Lake Kingdom. Brutals over the lake. Mm hmm. Alright, so that is where I'm going to be ending off this video. In the next video, we are going to be going through the Lake Kingdom. But for now, please remember to like, comment, and subscribe if you want. And I'll see you in the next video. Also, <laughs> look at Mario's face when you go to the save option. He is very happy to see that. Anyways, uh, bye.